Hello everyone, this is Fornholt here for another The Division 2 build vid video and um, what I have for you t uh, for this one is uh, a merciless build yes you heard it right we're back with the merciless and um, I'll be showing you how uh, my clan member built this one which I then for myself which is absolutely a beast and we'll get right to it in just a second so we'll be starting off with the specialization so um, for this one we are using the gunner specialization uh, we're using this it's because of the one the ammo uh, talent that this has which generates 10% of your total ammo uh, which is very important in the merciless build because merciless burns through ammo really quickly and we also have the rate of fire here which um, increases our rate of fire by 5% on kill for 5 seconds as well as the 10% weapon handling while not moving need to be motionless for 1 second so that will be added into the weapon handling we have for this build uh, which m basically makes the merciless like a laser um, because it uh, almost removes any of the recoil that this weapon has and we'll go straight into the build so we are using uh, as you can see the merciless i have this um god road with 15 percent rifle damage 17 percent critical hit damage and 9.5 percent critical hit chance so what we have for this weapon talent is the binary trigger so this weapon fires on trigger pull and release so if both bullets hits the same enemy it gains a stack so at seven stacks shooting an enemy deals plus 500 percent amplified damage and creates a 7 meter explosion de dealing 500% weapon damage as well consuming the stacks so um, as you all know this uh, this weapon has a really bad recoil so each time you press it uh, each time you shoot the first half um, it really moves around uh, violently uh, which is why we're using this build so this build is based on the weapon handling that we got uh, for this title update so they improved how weapon handling works uh, so let's get right into my secondary weapon so I'm using the LMG so this is uh, this comes with 15% um, LMG damage which I rerolled 10% uh, damage to target out of cover and 9.7% reload speed with strain so gain plus 10% critical hit damage for every uh, 0.5 seconds you are firing so this stacks up to five times so we almost get plus 50% critical hit damage on this build uh, but we're mostly using the merciless um, when we're running this build so this is a good secondary weapon to have uh, whenever we don't have any bullets because sometimes we do uh, uh, have situations where we run out of bullets because of how the merciless works and this MG5 LMG is a good savior for that situation. Um, I'm using the D50. Uh, this is just my go-to pistol um, whenever I'm running anything. And then um, for the gears, so for the mask, I'm using the Exotic Coyotes mask. So this comes with 15% weapon damage, 6% uh, critical hit chance, and 11.8% critical hit damage. And I'm using 11.6% critical hit damage mod. So, as you all know, we uh, this exotic has pack instincts, which gives us these buffs based on how we shot the last enemy. I mean, the distance between the enemy. So any of these are um, welcome buff uh, for this build. And then next up, we have our first piece of um, Providence defense. So. The set bonus that we got here is 15% uh, head damage for one piece and then plus 10% critical hit chance for two piece. Uh, this comes with 12% weapon damage, 8% headshot damage, and 10.9% critical hit damage. Uh, and I've slotted an 11.5% critical hit damage as well for the mod. And we're using the Vigilance Silent so it increases total weapon damage by 25%. So that's a big uh, increase for our weapon damage. So taking damage disables this buff for 4 seconds but uh, you you wouldn't notice that 4 seconds when you're right in the middle of a gunfight so that's a, that's an okay downside for this talent then next up is the the main 
uh, the core gear for this build which is the Vidmed yeah, vest so this is a name Petrov defense group so we you can craft this in the crafting bench so what we have is um, it has 14.5 weapon damage 6% um, critical hit chance I've rerolled that and 6.9% critical headshot damage I mean and I've slotted an 11.4 critical hit damage mod and the talent that we're um, utilizing for this build is the perfect brace so while in cover weapon handling is increased by 50% so that's a huge increase in weapon handling um, as you know weapon handling's max stat in the attributes is I think around 8% so having 50% just by being in cover is uh, makes the whole difference when using the merciless and then what we have for our gloves is the name uh, gloves which is the contractor gloves so this um, the Petrov defense group gives us a uh, plus 10% LMG damage for one piece and then another 10% weapon handling for this, the two piece so when we're um, in cover you we basically have almost 60% weapon handling just from the perfect brace and from the two piece uh, Petrov defense group set and then this is rolled with 15% weapon damage, 8% uh, damage to armor, and 12% critical hit damage. And then for the holsters, we have the 15% headshot damage. Um, for the holsters, we have the Providence second piece, the second piece of our Providence defense, which is the uh, gives us the second set bonus, which is 10% critical hit chance. Uh, this is rolled with 14.2 weapon damage, 6% critical hit chance, and 12.0 critical hit damage and lastly we have the name knee pads which is the fox sprayers our one piece of overlord armament this gives us 10% rifle damage and the core attribute is 15% weapon damage 8% damage to out target out of cover and 12% critical hit damage so in total we have around 60% of weapon handling which is a which makes a really a good difference um, i'll show you some gameplay in a sec just to give you um, a preview of how this works with uh, how the merciless works with weapon handling and then for the skills uh, i recommend using like the reviver hive um, just as a safe measure and basically any of the skills you want you can go with the assault turret you can go with the um, striker drone uh, I'm having fun using the decoy and yeah that's it so let's see the stats so weapon damage or we having 105 weapon damage for LMG so this has 48% critical hit chance uh, this will be improved because of the um, exotic max talent so this may come up to max 60% or maybe around 50 something which is perfectly fine this has 138.2% critical hit damage and 134.9% headshot damage and then what we have for our weapon handling it only shows 10% here but when we're in cover you can see all the difference so yes this is the merciless build um, I'll show you a clip uh, in just a sec on how it shows uh, how weapon handling affects merciless and yeah this is uh, a fairly easy enough build um, I suggest you try it this is um, a build that one of my um, discord friends showed me uh, special thanks to Almerith OG for the build and uh, hope you liked it do like and subscribe the channel and I'll see you in the next one Bornhold out.